In this video, I'm going to show you how to do really creative wall art. What you're going to need are the following. Embroidery hoops, three different sizes. Fabric. Scissors. A hot glue gun. Felt and a pen or pencil. The first step in creating your wall art is to take apart the embroidery hoops. And you're going to use the inside one just because it's easier. And you're going to want to measure it around with your pen or pencil. You're going to want to have enough room to wrap the, fab the felt around the hoops. So the way I do it is I put my pen or pencil at an angle and trace it all the way around the hoop. You want to make sure you do this the same way for all of them too. The second step is to cut out the outline of the circle. Now, in order to hot glue the felt to your rim, I suggest starting off with a little bit of glue on the side towards the bottom and centering the, the embroidery circle or hoop in the center of your felt. And then you just start gluing all the way around. And you can also, which I'm going to show you in a little bit, um, glue the rim of the embroidery so that it stays flush with the fabric and it'll make it, it it'll keep it taut better. While you're hot gluing the rim, you want to try to pull the felt a little bit to make it kind of taut. You don't want it to be loose because eventually you are going to be starting pinning stuff on here or, you know, taping stuff and you don't want it to sag at all. Now you want to pretty much just repeat the pro the first step on gluing it all the way around the hoop. You want to make sure that there's no extra felt around the rim of the hoop, just so it makes it clean. So just go ahead and get rid of that. The next step is the fabric. And you're going to do the, basically the same exact steps as you did with the felt, except for this time. You don't want to cut it like we did the felt just because you're going to wrap it around more so you want to have a little bit of extra fabric left over and you can obviously do this when you're doing your felt um, step but I did it separate but it's all completely up to you
Now with this step, I would suggest putting the hot glue inside of the rim and on the like the top portion of the rim, if that makes any sense. Um, and with fabric, you want to pull it really tight so that it looks really neat. And I would suggest, just because it's, it's a circle, so you want to make sure the fabric looks right, you would, you're going to pull to the right or to the left, but you want to keep pulling to the same side the whole time around. Don't worry about any extra fabric. Once you're completely done wrapping it, I'll show you what you can do to fix that. And see how I have extra fabric? Just want to grab your scissors again and cut it as close as possible. And it doesn't really have to be neat in the back because it's going to be flush up against the wall so you won't be able to see it. And this is a picture of the finished product. If you guys like the video, please comment, rate, and subscribe.